Good. Ready? Yep. My name is Philly Phil, and the name of the song is called I Wrote a Love Letter to Myself. Why? Because how could I love you if I don't love me first? It starts with the individual. I wrote a love letter to myself. My first love the most high, my second love is me. I wrote myself a love letter, I bought a card for me. Then bought myself some sexy roses and chocolate candy for me. Then took a date out on the town and my date was me. Taking me to Broadway plays and out to see the movies. And then dinner for one, that's me, myself, and only me. Cause all my life I gave out but never gave to me. Don't get it twisted, my desires unconditionally. But now it's time I give to me and then receive from me. For myself, preservation of deeds I'm doing me, it's like I'm Marry myself in holy matrimony. I got down on my knees, then I proposed to myself and said, I do to me. Through sickness and in wealth for my own mental health, on my own, I have to fall deeply in love with myself, or else I never sincerely, truly love no one else. That's why you have to sentimentally earn to learn to love yourself. First, bring something beautiful to life about yourself. I know you're able, you'll be stable, you're your value, you're your wealth, you're your health. You have to learn to love yourself. Your personality is priceless wealth. If it's great, you are top shelf. You're all that and that's a fact, but if your character is whack, you lack that real value. You lack that real wealth. Worth more than all the diamonds, movies, bling bling, and pearls in the world. And all the gold and all the platinum all over the world. It's being rich in character. Loving yourself, you'll be glad at you. You'll never ever be super mad at you. So you and your worst enemy would never ever get back at you. And this is true to you, to who, it's a sure enough fact for you. So be rich in hope, be rich in thought. Follow your dreams in this dream. Be kings and queens of your self-esteem. Be strong, content, and courageous with confidence. And the next time you look in the mirror, call yourself a superstar. Because beauty's in the eye to behold that God loves you. He created you, so love yourself just the way you are. And let your mind be your best friend. Because the devil's epitome is where we make our minds our worst enemy. So learn to love yourself. Don't buffle your fists up in the air like a champ. And put on that championship belt. And gain and maintain that self-love stimulation that your brain has never felt. So learn to love yourself. Learn to love yourself. Learn to love, 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 love yourself. So you can sincerely, truly love someone else. Fully filled.